Hello everyone and welcome back to the Math Puzzle Crash Course. We have a, a multiple operations problem here which uh, features some addition and multiplication um, all here in one equation. Uh, and that is 88 plus 12 times 1 times 0 equals what? Um, I could say equals x, equals y, equals a, whatever. This is basically, this is still an equation. It's equal to a question mark. So um, this is an equation uh, asking you to solve that and uh, determine what the answer is. So 88 plus 12 times 1 times 0 equals what? Um, you may already know the answer. You may have been able to do that pretty easily in your head. It's not a very difficult problem, uh, but if you'd like to try to solve this and you're not really sure, you can pause the video right here and we'll come back and go through this together. All right, so um, hopefully uh, everyone's remembered that multiplication has precedence over addition and subtraction. Remember that the uh, the order of remember that order of operations convention that you were taught in school. Um, normally, and I guess in North America, that'd be like an elementary school, um, primary school, maybe in the UK. Um, this is pretty pretty basic stuff once you get into uh, multiple operations. Um, and the order of operations is sometimes represented using acronyms. Uh, you may be familiar with things like PEMDAS or BODMAS. There's also BIDMAS, BEDMAS. Depends on, you know, what English-speaking country you might be from. Um, those are typical uh, acronyms. I think uh, in Germany they refer to Punkt for, Punkt for Stritch, which I believe the interpretation is a point before a line, but it's uh, I think describing the same order of operations. Um, these are just all simple memorization tools. Um, you got to be careful with these acronyms. They're six letters, uh, but they really only represent four steps. Uh, and that would be, uh, first of all, your parentheses or brackets. Uh, number two would be any orders um, that were coming out of BODMAS. You also have exponents uh, from PEMDAS. Um, it also includes things like square roots. Uh, the third step here would be multiplication and division left to right. Just remember that multiplication and division have equal precedence. Uh, division is really the same operation as multiplication. Division is just the same as multiplying by a reciprocal. Um, so, And then addition and subtraction would be your fourth step. Uh, subtraction is just the addition of a negative number. So addition and subtraction basically the same operation, they have equal precedence, uh, and those are solved left to right. So in this problem, we don't have any parentheses, uh, we don't have any orders or exponents, uh, we do have multiplication um, in step three, and we do have addition. So uh, we basically need to resolve that multiplication first. Just remember, multiplication is shorthand for repeated addition. Uh, so you have 12 times 1 times 0. You have two multiplications there. You have 12 times 1 is 12, but 12 times 0 is 0. So 12 times 1 times 0 equals 0. Uh, and so you end up with 88 plus 0 equals 88. So the answer to the problem is 88. Now, I will see a, a lot of problem uh, problems from people where they will try to go left to right and do 88 plus 12. Uh, which is incorrect. You do not just you do not you don't solve left to right, ignoring the order of operations. So uh, um, if you're uncertain about that, you know please go back and review it. Um, that that's a pretty early concept um, um, in elementary school. So I hope this has been helpful. And uh, please check out some of the other videos. Like, share, subscribe, and hope to see you all in the next video.